Just wanted to make sure my thing was recording there. Like I said, I'm going to do a little bit of sniping, so this might get a little boring for some people. But, uh, yeah. Just going to take check out the uh, new hover bench. Uh, and uh, let's grab ourselves, since we're going to be shooting long range stuff, I think uh, we might go with the uh, Barrett. So let's just grab this. Uh, did they fix? Uh, did Anton fix that? Yes, he did. And uh, oh, I already have one of these. Well, <laughs> let's just throw that one away. All right, and uh, instead of the eight by thirty-two, I am going to. Uh, let's see, attachments, magnifier, scope. I'm going to go with the uh, 12 by 60. Because I'm going to snipe. Oh. Did I put that one there? I must have. Now I have two of these. <laughs> All right, well, that's pretty cool. All right, so let me just uh, grab a seat here. Ooh, there we go. Don't have to stand around. Oops. Controller's freaking out there. <laughs> Grab this, and let's just put this up uh, like this for right now. I need to put this one in its proper spot. Make sure that's square. It's going to line up with the edge of the table here. All right, good stuff. I think, uh, good enough, right there. All right. So we're at the uh, 200, or sorry, 2,000 meter range. Let's just lock this into place, zero that rotation. And let's move this gun over here so I don't have to stand next to the table. Let's move a little further. <clears throat> Clear the throat. All right, we got some good, good picture here. Let's just move this one a little bit up. All right, so we got a snipe. <clears throat> All right, so this is the, uh, like I said, the two, 2,000 meter range or two kilometer range. So let's see if I can uh, move this. It's a little slow. I think I set it to 1x, right? Yeah, I did. Okay. Left, right. All right. Well, zoom in a little bit more. So I, I don't think we can hit 2,000 immediately, right? That's just going to be a little too hard. Let me just angle this down. So you know what? Let's work our way up to 2,000. Hopefully we can get to to uh, to 2,000 to, 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 to 2,000 today. That's a real, it's 2, 2,000. Okay, there you go. So let's uh, get down. Actually, where am I at now? Uh, 1,500. It's a bit slow. Because we're we are working at long distances here, so so one thousand two hundred. So okay, let's uh, let's get our base zero up. This is going to be one thousand. That's as far as this one goes. So one thousand is our base zero. All right, so let's figure out what our elevation is, and I think I know a way to do that if I remember. Uh, my lessons correctly. Let's uh, actually. Why is this really slow? Uh, hold on. Just a second. Let's zoom in a little bit. It just. Yeah, I guess it seems slow because we're zoomed out. If you if you zoom in, it's actually pretty fast. And let me uh, move this over here. Let's get the crosshair to the center of this guy. 1,200. Right, let's get a little bit closer. Okay, that should be center enough. All right, so let's do our little uh, prep here. Stick around in there. 
and make sure the safety's off. And let's start to snipe. Okay. All right. Oh, I also turned on um, uh, bullet trails to make it a little easier. You know? So, uh, all right. So if we saw where that bullet went, it went down to the, oops, the, what, the fourth line right there. So I think I just want to make sure we just do one more shot again. Yep, we're under the fourth line. So I think we need to increase our elevation. Oh, no, 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 wait. Hold on. Let me try this. Uh, let me move up. Am I moving up? Uh, there we go. Let's move up to the fourth line here. Let's put that center. And then let's increase our elevation and match it about 5.5 minutes of angle. Let's see if this hits dead on. Ooh, just a little bit. Where did that land? All right, we're at the second line now, so let's move this one up. Center. All right. Try this again. And let's uh, adjust our elevation. That we can have the crosshairs in the middle. 7.5 minutes of angle. Ooh, dead on hit, but it's a little too low. I think low to the right, just a little. But that's probably just mechanical accuracy. Again, it's, it can vary, so we'll do one more shot here. Yeah, that was a little closer to where the crosshair center was, I think. Yeah, okay. Pretty much got it uh, dead on. Although with a little variance to, uh, you know, left and right. But uh, any, like, any change in windage, I don't think is going to help that. But, uh, yeah, so we got that set up. All right. So that's 1,200 meters or 1.2 kilometers, I think. That's how it works, right? All right, let's move to 1,250 meters. So we just need to go up. One up. I swear, this thing is pretty slow for some reason, but, uh, yeah. It just looks slow because we're all zoomed out. When we zoom in all the way, it actually moves pretty fast. Just... Okay. Going to go 1,250. Okay. Dead on center. Move this up. That's uh, pretty much center of the target. Maybe a little bit to the yeah. There we go. Just need to just need to edit this. There we go. Okay. It's pretty much center. Do we have any uh, rounds? We have three so let's see where these rounds land right about the second line there there's the the crosshair center and then there's uh one one uh dash or whatever it's called i forgot what it's called hash mark it's a hash mark right so about two hashes two and a half Two and a quarter. All right, we're out. So let's uh, let's move this up about two and a quarter. So two and a quarter. That right, right about there. All right, let's dial in the elevation. About uh, 10 minutes of angle. We'll try that. Let's take another magazine in. 
All right, let's see if this uh, shot lands. Oh, I missed that. I didn't see it. One more time. Ah, uh, quite, uh, quite low. Probably about one hash. One hash. Yeah, seems like it. We're just barely missing the target. So let's move this up a bit, about right there. And let's increase our MOA. Ooh, pretty good. Although again, the mechanical accuracy means that the bullets will kind of kind of move over uh, several places, but uh, it's pretty much close to center as you can get. Oh, that one kind of missed. That one's pretty good. Oh, yeah. And we're out. Okay. Pretty cool. 1,250. Now. All right. So what next? What should I do next? Should I go for 1,500 or... You know what? I'm going to try some of these smaller targets here. You got some of these... Uh, these uh, these small, like, I don't know what you call them. Plates? Swinging plates? I don't know. Uh, we're just going to move this over. There we go. Now we can see them. Okay, let's get that centered. Uh, close enough. Move it down a bit. And see if we uh, are accurate. That's about as close to center as I can get it. Let's stick this inside. Yeah, this hover bench is really good. All right, let's see if we can hit this uh, first plate. Ooh, just to the uh, left a bit. Oh, that one's wild. Not to the right. I hit the uh, <laughs> I hit the second plate again. Mechanical accuracy, so it's kind of random there. Ooh, so close! Just a little bit more to the center. Okay, I think I am definitely. Oh, I hit something. Let's try that again. Oh, this cable. I need to move it. Okay. I think we might need to... Uh, I might need to move this up a bit. Let's see. Hold on. Let's try this. Oops. Yeah, that might be going over. We had something. Hmm. I don't know if we're hitting it or going over. I can't really tell. But actually go a little lower yeah these uh, small targets are pretty hard especially with that mechanical accuracy you know what let's try the other target uh, the uh, other silhouette like right next to it there we go 
Come on, grab the thing. There we go. Okay. All right. It should be a hit. Yep. Maybe that. Uh, maybe those uh, little tiny uh, plate targets are a little too hard to hit. There are bigger ones though. But they're all the way to the side, and yeah. See, you see them on the side there. They're a little too hard. All right, well, you know what? Let's move on to 1,500 meters. This one is empty. Okay. So let's move to 1,500. Okay, let's push forward. That's what you do to elevate up. Okay, we're there, and we're just going to move to the right. All right, let's zoom this baby in. Getting a little farther now. All right, let's see where our shot lands. <clears throat> oh, way down there. Okay. Oh, all right. So let's just move our view up to the lowest we can get, which is over here. Am I grabbing the right thing? There we go. That's as far as I can get it. And let's adjust the elevation. And see where, where we need to adjust further, so. All right, okay, I think that was probably the third hash, you know, that third dot. One more shot. Yeah, okay, so let's move this up. Go into this third one. Change the elevation. Let's go with 20, 20 minutes of angle. Ooh. Right up to that second hash. So let's move that up a bit. Right there. And let's, ooh, adjust this. I kind of messed that up, I guess, but uh, it's okay. 22 minutes of angle. We hit something. Just a little more. Okay. Let's, let's back up. I think it was a little uh, higher than the hash, though. Although, again, I'm just doing this... Like, I don't have any knowledge about this stuff, so... <laughs> How much ammo we got? We got two more shots. Okay, okay, we're getting there. Just a little more. But maybe a couple shots, because again, mechanical accuracy. You never know. Alright, I think we need to move a little higher. Maybe like this. 25 minutes of angle. Oh, nope. 24.75. Let's try that. There we go. Nice hit. Nice hit. Rounds on target. Okay. Let's try a couple more. Eh, yeah, I kind of bounced off the uh, side there. Right there. Okay. It's a little low. I can... I can... I can I think I see it's a little low. Oh no, that was uh that was pretty dead on. I wish I had a spotting scope. And that was to the side a bit. Mm, that was yeah, again pretty dead on. This 
one's gonna miss. Yep. <laughs> you can tell by the, uh, <clears throat> again, mechanical accuracy. I can't really do much about that. Although when Anton implements wind, this is going to be real tough. Because now you're going to have to, uh, either I think wind or the Coriolis effect. That stuff is like complex right there. I'm going to have to uh, read up on that. All right, let me just, uh, oop, let me clear empty mags. So that's uh, 1,500. Now we're going to get... Uh, oh, we might try 1,800. But you know what? Before we do, let's actually hit that other target to the uh, right. So let's zoom this in a little bit so we can uh, speed up the process. All right, where are we at? Oh, there we go. There's the other target. Let's just get this one right at the center. Let's increase the magnification as, <laughs> as much as we can. This is 60 times already. This is pretty hard to see. Okay, let's see if we can get a hit on this. this should, they should be in the same range, but sometimes the target's a little further forward or back. And uh, let me just adjust my headset here. Ooh, all right. That was pretty, uh, that was pretty good. I actually hit it. All right, well, <laughs> I guess we'll move on to uh, 1,800. This is going to be tough. This is the limit, I think. Uh, and, uh, yeah. I don't know if I will be able to uh, make this, but, oh, I think I overshot it. I want to go up, I want to go up, keep going up. Oh, come on. There we go. Let's get that centered. Let's get this zoomed in as close as we can. Okay, here we go. 1,800. This is going to be tough. <clears throat> that one landed way down there, so we're going to have to move this uh, move this thing up. So let's just do that and then increase our elevation to about... 30 minutes of angle. We'll see where this lands. Was that the uh, fourth hash mark? Fourth dot? A little bit lower than the fourth one. So, should adjust. Uh, about here, right? Okay, let's continue increasing the elevation. Zero this thing in. 35.5 will be a nice uh, test. Okay, all right. We're down to, uh, let's see, two and a half hashes. Just, I want to say... Two and a half, so right about here. And I think we are a little off center. Let's put that there. And then let's increase our elevation. About 38.5 or 25. There we go. Minutes of angle. All right, I think we need to increase it a little bit more, about two. There we go. And we got to keep increasing this. We're getting 40.5 there. 
Still got about three rounds. Three rounds, yep. We're going to do three rounds. Sending it. Yeah, it's just on the hash. Or the, uh, whatever it's called, the line. All right. So I'm going to keep increasing. Right? I think it was the second one. I, th I think. Kind of trying to remember here. All right. Let's increase this to about 42.75. Oh, it, I think it was above, right? So we're slowly getting there. Uh, yeah, I think so. You know what? Let me give a nice check here. Hold on. Oh, yeah, we're... Hmm. Increase it more, I guess. And then let's adjust the elevation. Oh, this one is off center now. There we go. Let's see. Oh, so close. I think I might be doing something wrong. Oh, I hit it. All right. So that's where we need to zero to. That might have been kind of a lucky shot, but we'll see. That was pretty good. I hope I got that on camera. That's a, that was a, that was pretty impressive. Let's see if we can get another shot there. Oh, just a little. I think it hit the frame. Let me try one more time. Oh, yeah, there we go. We got a good hit. Oh, that was, I think, over? Ah, there we go. Nice. I might have been swinging. That that was probably it. I don't. I can't really tell if it's hitting like direct dead center, but we're hitting the target. Oh my goodness! Can't believe we're out. Oh, that was wild and to the left. This one should be. Yep, that was a hit. All right, I can't believe I actually hit that. Are there any targets over here? Okay, there's one at the back that's 2,000 meters. I don't know. I don't know if I should go for that. Because it's, it's directly at the back wall. Uh, oh, man. Should I go for that? Yeah, see, it's a little farther back, so that's hitting... I don't know if that's actually 2,000, but... It uh, doesn't seem like it. It should be smaller, right? That's, what, 200 meters more? So... I don't know if we can hit it, but if we can hit it, then I can call this video a success. Well, as, as, as successful as I can probably get it, because I'm not really too skilled at this kind of stuff. There's probably an easier way, too. You know, you got to do all the math and stuff and and calculate and, you know, divide. And I, I don't, I'm not really too good with the math. So, yeah, I'm just doing this by, I think this is like, uh, just by... Uh, Failing a whole bunch of times. That's what I'm doing. Okay, yeah, that is definitely off. So let's move this up about... 
about here. And then let's increase our elevation. A couple more. There we go. My right eye is so tired. I gotta learn to stop closing my right eye. Okay, that was a little low. Again, we'll move up again. And again, we'll change the elevation again. <laughs> I don't even know why I'm breathing. I'm not even uh, holding this thing. This thing is being held by the hover bench. I think that was uh, low. Yeah, we need to move it up a little bit more. All right. Let's increase this MOA to about... 55.5. Also, it is off-center. Okay. I need to stop closing my other eye. Ooh, just... Just a little more. It was right over here, right? Increase the MOA a bit more. About 57.5. Let's try that. Even more. Wow, okay. Keep doing this. Fifty nine point seven five. Okay, we're getting there. It was slightly above, so sixty one point seven five. Let's move this a bit center. There we go. Oh, I didn't see what that was. Give him uh, another magazine in there and see. Uh, wasn't watching. Just a couple more. Actually, you know what? Let me just see if uh, this is doing anything. A little more. getting there. It's hitting the base of the target. Just gonna keep doing this until we get it. The 7.25. Ooh, so close. A little more, like right about there. I think that's 68 minutes of angle? Really? Wow. Oh, nice. We got a hit. Let me just move this over to the center. Let's see if we can repeat that. Bam! That is a solid hit. Oh, that, this one's gonna miss. Yeah. Ooh, nice. I actually dialed it in. Wow. Okay. All right. So, that's not 200 or 2,000 meters. I don't think so. Because, again, it would be probably smaller. But, uh, that is pretty cool. Oh, I missed. Ugh. The reload. 
Uh, that one's a miss. This one's a hit. I can feel it. Yeah, nice. Wow. This is so cool. Didn't think I'd be able to I would, uh, ever hit uh, something that far. But uh, yeah, I mean, uh, again, I'm kind of I'm kind of cheating with the uh, hover hover bench. Uh, trying to do this uh, freehand or with a bipod, that's going to be pretty tough. Actually, you know what? Since we got it, since we got it down, let's see if we can hit it uh, with the bipod. This is gonna, this is gonna be tough. But uh, <laughs> it's gonna, yeah, it's probably not gonna work. But uh, just uh, ah, grab this. All right, well, this is going to be a terrible idea, but <laughs> I'm going to see if I can hit this with a bipod. <clears throat> oh, man, this is, this is going to be bad. Where is it? I need to zoom out. Okay. Ooh. Let's see if we can hit it. Oh my god, I hit it. Oh my god, I actually hit it. Oh my. Well, I mean, look, I can tell you one thing. If you properly sight, uh, calibrate, and zero your uh, your scopes, you can actually... Uh, you know what? Let's, let's see. One more time. One more time. Let's see if I can do that again. All right. This is 1,500, 1,008. Right there. Okay. Let's see if we can get this. Oh, I think I missed. I think I missed. No, I hit it. I hit it. Oh, <laughs> oh man. Wow. All right. I kind of missed that one. Yeah, I was... Uh... Oh, where is it? Yeah. All right. I I need to save this. All right. This weapon needs to be saved. In fact, I think uh, Anton mentioned that in the uh, dev log that uh, you can actually save your. Uh, whoa. Please. Okay. You can actually save your um, your your profiles or whatever. It, it saves it in the uh, the. Um, the the vault so whatever you set on your scope it actually saves so i'm gonna save this that's my long range okay there we go i had to delete some uh, well i delete all of my stuff since uh this new uh new um not delete but i i backed up most of my um vault files but uh because of the uh, new bullet, uh, the the new uh, ballistic system, so I'm gonna have to remake all of my stuff uh, with various uh, cal uh, calibrated zeros for different ranges. So this is gonna be my long range, about two. I wonder if I can do a freehand. This is gonna be tough. Oh no, <laughs> yeah, no the. Uh... Yeah, that that I'm not gonna try to attempt to do, but I can't believe I actually hit that that uh, that target at that distance. But again, again, like I said, once you cal once you calibrate and properly zero your sights, yep, it saved all my settings. So that's pretty good. Sixty eight 
minutes of angle zeroed at 1000 so that is pretty cool so yeah like yeah just calibrate your sights calibrate your scopes zero your scopes zero your everything and uh, you can probably hit whatever you're trying to aim at oh man my my face is tired specifically from uh, squinting trying to see down that uh, scope but uh, yeah this is a real cool real cool uh, little tool that Anton put in helps you uh, properly oh, what's with the slowdown I think it's because I'm recording but it helps you properly uh, calibrate your stuff so if you really want to calibrate your your sniper rifles and your scopes and whatever yeah use that thing the hover sled or hover <laughs> hover bench because uh, yeah then you can start hitting uh, hitting targets out 2,000 kilometer or 2,000 uh, 2,000 meters two kilometers but uh, yeah oh man that was fun that's that's great this is uh, this is pretty cool <laughs> so I'm glad Anton's adding all this uh, complicated stuff because hey you know gives you a chance to learn and uh, and it's fun so yep that's about it for today hopefully the video didn't go too long but uh, I'll see you guys next time